and put his arm around my waist. And I couldn't say anything because I couldn't speak. Another time, Victor again, when I was 14 and he was grown up. He picked me up to cross the stream and I was shaking so much, my teeth started chattering. The trouble was, I felt ashamed. With my husband, it's something else again. My father gave me to him and I was happy about that. That's absolutely true. And from the moment I knew I was to be married to him, I thought, I thought about children. And I looked at myself, reflected in his eyes. And yes, there I was, very small, at his bidding, as if I was my own child. I'm not empty. I'm slowly filling with hate. Tell me, please. Is that all I can do? Just keep on looking for the man inside the man. Or else... What are you supposed to think when he rolls into his side and just goes to sleep? And you're left there, looking sadly up at the ceiling. Am I just supposed to keep on thinking of him? Or what could come out of my belly? Shining. I don't know anymore. Please tell me. Girls like me, girls who grew up in the country. It's all words left only half said, gestures only half made, because these are the things you're just not supposed to know. And you, you stay quiet too, and then off you go, looking like you know, like you know the answers to everything, but won't tell me. Don't tell me, even though you know, I'm dying of thirst. <laughs>